Little People Big World's Matt Roloff was forced to call 911 after his $4 million home suffered a major fire, the incident caught in a terrifying video. Matt hoped to pass the family farm on to one of his oldest sons, Jeremy or Zach, though neither of the siblings has seemed totally interested in following Dad's career path. The video clip was shown at the end of the most recent episode of Little People Big World as a promo for next week's broadcast of the TLC series. In the video, firefighters rush to put out the flames threatening to burn down one of the several barns on the property. Matt sits in disbelief and bemoans to the camera person. 100-year-old barn. Dreadful. Though the farm fire is just now being aired on the show, The Sun previously reported on the incident back in January when it happened. Matt took to Instagram and revealed a real scary story that happened to his 110-year-old sweet building. Firefighters arrived at the Rolla Farms due to a fire in the chicken barn. The Little People Big World star managed to save the barn thanks to his farmhand Jason and their up-to-date fire extinguishers. Just before 4 in the morning, the reality star saw the commotion in the chicken barn outside his window. He wrote that smoke was pouring out the sides, then added that luckily there were no chickens injured in the event. He claimed that the fire might have been caused by a light falling to the floor. While sharing photos of charred wood, Matt jokingly concluded that there was never a dull moment here on the farm. The 100-acre farm in Helvetia, Oregon, just 15 miles outside of Portland, is run by patriarch Matt after his divorce from his ex-wife Amy. The family purchased the small fixer-upper property back in 1990 when it was a beat-up old farmhouse, broken-down barn and overgrown peach orchard. Over the years, Rolla Farms has garnered visitors and can be seen on the TV show. Back in May 2021, Matt revealed to a fan when he was asked if Jeremy bought the farm. No, not yet. No, we haven't settled what we're going to do with the farm, it's all being discussed actively. Audrey wrote on Instagram that if they had not bought the farm, it was the death of a dream. Jeremy and Audrey are the parents of daughter Amber, son Bode, and their newborn baby Radley. Son Zach also expressed his desire to buy the farm, but he ended up moving to Washington with his wife Tori and their two children, Jackson and Lila, in October. When asked about buying the farm, Tori wrote on her Instagram story, Some things just don't go according to plan, but it all worked out for us. Matt has continually worked on remodeling and renovating the buildings on the property. The TLC star made major upgrades to the property during the pandemic and shared the updates on the Oregon family farm on Instagram. He captioned the series of snaps. After a very productive three weeks back at the farm, logs are prepped for the new cabin, lawns are all fertilized and mowed, new employees hired and trained for the summer season, goats and sheep groomed and happy, big house cleaned and painted, birthdays celebrated, grandkids played with, fields plowed, new house designed with permits submitted. The farm is under control, new COVID cleaning procedures are in place. Now time to catch my breath before real summer work begins. One photo reveals a luxurious modern yet rustic home with a wood-beamed ceiling, decorative stone wall, spacious glass windows and expansive outdoor patio perfect for entertaining. The TLC star also showed a stack of logs he prepared to create a small log cabin on Rolla Farms. One fan asked on Instagram, where is the log cabin going? Is it for pumpkin season or the grandkids? Matt responded, both. He also shared a photo of the chicken coop, but it is the large rustic but ridzy home revealed that has fans of the show buzzing. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.